So I've released quite a few videos of Sideswipe on the channel now, and you guys seem to really enjoy the variety on the channel. So I thought I'd show you guys the very first games of the first season of Sideswipe that I played. Now, I'm going to be honest with you, these games were recorded over a week ago, and it's crazy how much I've improved since then, but it's also crazy how much the opponents have improved. Today's my first 1v1 games, but in a couple days I'll show you guys some matches up in Diamond with Danny and 2v2. I hope you guys enjoy, let's get right into it. All right, here we go. I, I am uh, really excited to play this game again. I haven't played for about five days. I'm a little bit behind on the uh, the uh, pr the season one here. Hopefully I can shoot this. Nice save. Ooh. Bang, there we go. Nice, good, good first shot of the day. Well, I guess not really first shot of the day. I did do the practice round to make sure everything was working. I had to reset my, my bindings and stuff. Good start. This guy's pretty solid. There we go. Nice. I got a nice block on the way down. Feeling pretty good so far. Um, I did end up at, like, I think it was uh, high plat and low diamond in all the ranks in the preseason. He backed off. There. Oh! Okay, there we go. <laughs> off the crossbar. Um, by the way, um, if it hasn't been shown already, uh, Mr. Swaggles is working on a uh, side swipe map. Uh, in Rocket League, and uh, I helped build some things in it. I just own gold. <laughs> um, and uh, wow, one one goal, and he's already saying nice shot a bunch. That's uh, that's cool. Oh no! Oh, I tried to block it. it was so close. I guess you're just saying nice shot because I scored it. But uh, yeah, so the side map in Rocket League is going to come soon. Uh, it's a very small map. Oh! <laughs> oh, he's not happy with that one. I need to get those eggs. Those eggs are funny. There we go. I feel pretty, pretty confident. I did stream this game on uh, Twitch for a while. And uh, it's climbing pretty fast in the preseason. Oh my goodness. It's a nice little snipe. And uh, we're looking good. So there's not much to say about this game. It's the one thing that I find commentary wise, like just trying to block the players. In 1v1, it becomes very much like a kickoff simulator. Oh my god, that would have been <laughs> insanely cracked. It's just in. Seven to two. Oof. I'm not really sure how the ranks distribution is now because of the uh, season, but in in gold and, and platinum, it was very sweaty in the preseason. But it must have been all the sweaty tryhards that were joining the game too early. And uh, now we have the players who are kind of the regular player base. Because I actually recognize a lot of names in the preseason. Uh-oh. Oh. All right, here we go. Oh, so close. All right. The GG. Pretty for pretty good first game. Hopefully we get two bars here. We can move up to gold 2 already. I'm not really sure how the uh the season's going to work compared to the preseason, but the preseason was pretty slow. You have to like go one bar up. Oh. Okay, two bars. So you have to fill the bars and then also win another match. So we're still in gold 1. Now, what I do like about Sideswipe is that it's only two minute ma uh, matches, which it actually feels just as fast or just as long as a normal Rocket League game, just because there's so many goals happening. But um, it is nice to have uh, only two minute matches. So if you're like in a, in a rush or something and you want to play for a little bit, you can uh, quickly play a game and then get out of the game uh, as soon as possible. Uh oh, nice little dunk on the bottom. I don't like this. Why is this guy's name? I'm not even going to say it. Why is his name like that? Double reset. Don't worry. Don't worry. See? It's all good. I had it under control. <laughs> okay. I suck. Easy. <laughs> 
he's got a WoW Gold Explosion. I didn't even know that was a thing. Well, um, interesting gameplay for me on this one. What am I doing? I'm absolutely zero boost. Okay, he skied it. There we go, finally. I don't know how many open nets I missed, but it's okay. It happens. Sometimes, yeah, I, I'm not used to, I'm still not used to the flick. I mean, the uh, flips, the way that it goes. Um, it always goes in the direction that you're facing instead of just flat. And that really, like, it's hard to get over. Definitely. Oh, I just saved it again. <laughs> well, GG. What, a, what an interesting game. That was uh, definitely not my best performance. But we still get the win here. Hopefully, uh, we should be gold too, obviously, because we're at four four bars. But with so many bars, we get into gold too. Hopefully, more than one. Pain. That's okay. So it might be a longer climb than I think. But we've only we've only played two game two games so far, so it's not too bad. I'm not gonna lie, I kind of like the the little squares for the rank ups. It makes it very simple to know like just how many games you need. Versus uh you know the MMR system that's very hidden in Rocket League, but here you can see, okay, I probably need one to two matches. It would be nice to know like how many you're gonna win for the game you're playing. I'm on goaling. I thought I had to flip to pop it over the, the backboard, but instead I just score it score it off the top uh of the net. Oops. It's all good. Interesting play. There we go. Play it nice and soft. My mistake last time was to try and flip into it, but you can just pop the ball. I was sitting in training and the ball was rolling into me. It pops off your car pretty hard in this game compared to uh, compared to regular Rocket League. Make sure I don't commit here. What? <laughs> no! I've never seen that before. There's some really crazy uh, stickers. Oh my gosh, I sent that flying. There we go, nice. It's really, I, I find that the air roll system is kind of interesting. I mean, you do air roll and then sometimes your car is like, your roof is on your, on the ball and sometimes it's not. It's like very hard to say. I just own gold again. But I, I, I find it a little bit interesting. I feel like it'd be nicer if uh, it was more automatic. That if you were in air roll mode, you could get a flip reset. Right now it's very awkward uh, to know whether or not your car is going to be on the right timing or not. Because there's a bit of glue to the cars. If, if you if you know what I mean. Basically, it glues your car to certain surfaces when you go near them and stuff. It's a nice shot. Like right here, I'm flying upwards. You can do this thing where you go against the roof over and over again. Uh, as long as you keep jumping. And your car will like adjust to the surface. There we go. Right there, I just boosted backwards a little bit to get the uh, the backboard read. Those are really good to do when you go for the backboard. Just boost away from the ball a little bit, and you uh, you get in a better position to shoot it a little harder, especially when they're on the ground like that. I find in 1v1s, uh, the low net is kind of ridiculous up until Platinum when they move the net up. You actually end up playing in the 2v2 arena if you haven't reached Platinum yet. You, you definitely should try to reach that in ones because it makes 1v1s a lot more fun. I, I understand why they did it. Because the players who are lower level can't really score a high ball, maybe. But there's something about a very low low net that basically whenever you roll the ball there, it's basically like you're done for. You can't save it. You can't jump above it because the net's right there. You're going to fall into the net. So it makes it difficult when you get against players who are really good at this rank to prevent own goaling or uh, scoring when they're trying to pop it over you. This guy is freestyling. Just like constantly air rolling in the air. Whoop. Oh, I almost saved it. It went pretty high on that. It actually popped underneath me. I could have went probably high to force it above the net. That was close. No, I own gold again. <laughs> oh my goodness. This guy was preseason platinum, so he's a little bit lower rank than, than my rank that I was at, but...
like this. I can't really do anything about it because I'm like right there, but I can score this. This is like very difficult with the net being so close to the ground. I'm not a big fan of that, but hopefully we can make it out of here and get to Plat because Plat is much nicer in 1v1. Here we go. Bang, straight shot. Really solid. But that's a pretty good shot right there. Um, those pinches are so nice on this map. Uh, even on the 2v2 map too, it actually works out really well. Just to pinch it on the ceiling, it'll go right into the net. I think the 2v2 map is also like slightly bigger. Oh, so close. All right, I'm out of boost. Let's land here. Might just go in. Yes, sir. All right, we got the good lead now with 36 seconds. It's crazy how like that's still only that's still a quarter of the game left. Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> yeah. What do you guys think of side so far? So far, um, I really do enjoy it. I w I wish that I would have played more recently. I would have liked to get in a higher rank when the season right like just started. But I've been really busy with obviously the Facebook, uh, gaming posts and the uh, uh, all that stuff. I've got the channel set up. Um. Been a lot of fun to play different games. I don't know if you. I know a lot of people have been complaining about you know getting an account on Facebook or whatever. Um, I understand that, and it's totally cool if you don't want to. There's no reason to uh, complain. I mean, it's just additional content. It's, not, it's it's totally different from Rocket League most most of the time. I probably won't do very many Rocket League games that are or videos that aren't on the main channel. Uh, but I'm enjoying playing different games. Danny's loving it too. He's loving editing something different, and I'm really enjoying like just testing out different variety of content because I. I do want to play more FPS stuff like I do on stream because I used to main FPS games. Uh, I've been enjoying Halo. Played COD a little bit, but it's not like anything cra- Oh, he missed. Should have realized that. Um, I've been enjoying playing different things. Oh, we own gold again. Uh, by again, I mean another guy own gold. <laughs> but yeah, I've been enjoying playing different games and it actually makes Rocket League content a lot more fresh. Also, Sideswipe's helping a lot to do fresh content and stuff. You guys seem to really like it, so I've been uh, trying to get more of that. Uh, as you saw, uh, Danny challenged me to a 1v1 in this uh, before the preseason ended. I think it was like the last day before the season ended as well, or the preseason ended. But yeah, I've just been really enjoying playing different games. Uh, I do obviously play different games on my free time, but something about recording it and like trying to be entertaining, uh, that actually makes the gameplay more fun for other games as well. Uh, and recording a lot of muck too. Muck is hilarious. Like every every time I play that game, uh, it's always different, and there's something crazy happening. And I really do enjoy how the game feels too. It's a very natural feeling. Danny, uh, when I say Danny, by the way, this is D A N I Danny. Um, he uh, is really good at making games. I really love his YouTube channel. He makes a lot of crazy uh, a lot of crazy games. And uh, Crab Game and and Muck are S tier games, honestly. There we go. Nice. So I'm kind of autopiloting and we're 30, 30 seconds into this game. I kind of feel bad for this guy. Um, but there we go. Uh, we, we get two bars. Right, honestly, we're moving up pretty fast. We can actually move into platinum pretty quickly in this in this uh, episode. All right. We got Battle of Troy. See if he saves it. There's a flip reset here. Surprised he didn't use it. Um, he definitely had another one. He could have popped it over me. That's why I was waiting for that. But uh, instead, he just kind of dropped it on the floor. And on those open nets, you got to be a little bit careful with just trying to flick it too hard because uh, you can tend to like get the back end of your your car and like send it into the crossbar. I've noticed that a lot. So when you have an open net, I just tend to like try to like just single jump, pop it open. Ooh, nice touch. A good finish. I really, I really hope that Rocket League starts to make more unique maps with this game. Because, uh, oh, it went up. Because um, there's so much potential for this game to be so much fun in, in so many different ways. Just like regular Rocket League 2, you know. I really enjoyed the Heat Seeker Ricochet games. Uh, those are really fun. I still need to mess with those maps as well for a video. I, uh, I have some ideas. Also, I went back a year ago. And saw a comment on the find the ball, uh, find the ball games. The I don't know if you guys have seen that. It's the jungle map with the the ball spawns in different spots. And someone suggested to do a, a free for all. Uh, I'm gonna get scored on here. Oh, never mind. 
a free for all that where everyone has to find the ball separately, which I think is a really cool idea. And we can almost do like a elimination thing where when you find the ball, you're out of the game until the next round, and whoever's last to find the ball and get it in uh, loses. Which is sort of like a 1v1v1, but it's uh, find the ball instead. I just own gold. Never mind. That's a good touch. Oh, that's a good shot. Nice little pinch. I think we got two shots for that. I don't know what just happened. It was kind of weird. Nice finish. Yeah, I've just been uh, I've been enjoying this game. I think it's really really solid. I think they have a good foundation. Uh, I I think there's a lot of potential though for the future. And uh, with Rocket League going for Unreal Engine Five stuff, uh, I think that they're going to start experimenting more. So it's just a matter of patience. I have no, I have no flip. There we go. Nice finish. Twelve to two. So we're in gold. I mean, it's uh, it's not the highest of regs, obviously, but I think that the highest is grand champion in in sideswipe. I wonder if they've added SSL in the season. We shall see. But the audio is getting really baked now. This is happening in the last episode too. Oh, so close. All right, GG. So that should move us into, I believe, gold four. I can't remember where the last game was. Yes, gold four. All right, so we only have, um, we only have a few more games to go to get to platinum. So we'll, uh, I'll restart real quick and then we'll uh, get into the last games. We got the Apollo. I actually wanted to try the uh, the Diestro or whatever that, that new car is in the, uh, the Rocket Pass. Um, I saw someone using it, I think, in t this episode. What a shot off the backboard. That was quick. Oh my goodness. Yeah, his name reminded me of the Diestro for some reason. I guess there's a D and E and O. And a zero, I think? Those are zeros, maybe. There we go. Nice. So I boosted back a little bit to follow that. If I didn't boost back, I wouldn't have been able to shoot that in the, the angle I was at. Pretty solid. Close. Woo! No. No. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, it's okay. Pretty low scoring game, though, compared to the other ones. Been towards the net. Nice. Pretty good shot, though. And there we go. This game feels very natural to me. Uh, I'm definitely getting used to the controls. There we go. All right. Pretty quick game here. This seems to be a rinse repeat of these uh, goals. Um, I just keep going off the ceiling and then shooting it or off the kickoff, it booms into the net. <gasps> what am I doing? Uh oh, score it. There it is. All right, you got a goal. A little bit of a forced error there. I kind of jumped over him. He's preseason gold too. So he played a bit of preseason, but not too much. And there we go. Hopefully we get two bars maybe. Yes. Okay. So we maybe got like three or four more wins if we win every single game. And uh, and then we can move into platinum. And then the, get the goals will be higher and the map will be bigger. And that'll be nice for the next episode. A Gorg M. He's got a watermelon on his head. I actually removed my hats. I need to put a hat back on. Oops. Uh oh. That's probably a goal too. What a shot. That was interesting. I've never seen that before. <laughs> I think he mistakenly hit it off the, the ramp, but then he adjusted to fix it. It was well played. Nice. I tried to get a flip reset like three times there. It kept bouncing off my car. I think this game really needs a replay system. Not only like a replays of goals, but also a replay system to actually save a game. It's definitely something I feel like this game is lacking, but hopefully they'll introduce it in the future. I just feel like it'd be nice to watch the perspective of the goal from a wider angle. Oh! 
Oh! Oh, what a save! Oh my gosh! That was actually really good. Uh to go for uh the pinch off the player. Like I would have liked to watch that back. I kinda like used a flip on the ceiling to do a wave dash of sorts. And it actually made me a lot faster. Like I kinda did this. And then went down down towards with the flip still because I was still on the on the ceiling. Nice, good flick. You can get a lot of power off those last second flicks off that back end of the car. Should be a goal here. Nice. So I don't know if score matters in this game. I was trying to figure that out. Like if you really score high on somebody, do you get more? Oh, okay. Uh, and if you own gold, do you get less, less MMR? <laughs> that was a good shot for me. Nice. A nice little block. Yeah, he tried to pass it back to me. Or he tried to pass it over my head. But I was back up on the ceiling. I feel kind of bad being kind of ruthless with these games. But I'm just trying to rank up as fast as possible. I'm hoping that... Uh, they don't sit the whole whole game through. But they kind of are. So it's fine. What flip reset? Oh gosh. Try to get a flip reset there as well to get some... Uh, if you touch the ball with your uh, wheels, you do get some boost back. Oh, what a block. <laughs> that was that was a bad mistake by me. I, I can't, definitely can't be doing that at the higher ranks if I want to avoid goals. Because I basically forced him into a position where he, he can't really mess up. Oh my gosh, hit the ceiling too. Nice. Just sat there trying to bait him in for the next touch. He was, I was sort of just air rolling and, and air dribbling it. By the way, speaking of air dribbling, uh, on stream I did like a three minute air dribble. Um, if you guys want to see like a longest attempt at an air dribble, I can record a video just doing that, but I don't want it to be super boring. I feel like that would be really boring to watch. All right, we got the zero seconds. So I'm gonna do a GG here. Well played. I mean, I, f I feel like maybe because I waited a little bit too much time to play the season out, there's a lot lower ranked players here rather than the higher ranked players that are trying to skip f past these ranks. But we're in gold five. Got one bar again, so we need to get uh, three more. All right, we got another player. So close to platinum now. I uh, went down, it's unfortunate. I'm going to try and flip over the ball. That's, that was really tough. There was a bit. Of, I thought it wasn't going to go high enough, but I got just underneath the ball enough to flick it up. Like I said, the ball's pretty bouncy in sideswipe compared to the regular ball. I feel like the touches are pretty strong. Hopefully that's fast enough. I should not have done that. That was so bad. Yeah. I had no boost to follow that through to get back down to the ground. I need to make sure I stay grounded a little bit. The ground is the only place you can get boost. So well, any any surface their wheels are touching, really. It's pretty solid. I can feel it. Oh, the roll of the ball. I always forget about that. <laughs> nice little pinch. Yeah, I can definitely feel that, feel that this guy is uh, a lot stronger of a player. Uh, just based on his uh, dribbles and positioning and stuff. Nice. Nice, good finish. Got that flip reset pretty early. I don't even, I don't even know if he saw what I was doing. He probably saw it, obviously, because he has the ball cam. I'm not really sure how the camera works in this game. I'm trying to figure it out. It kind of like follows the ball a little bit in your car. Like it's a median point between the two. Like I said, a goal replay of the whole field would be nice, especially at the size of the maps here. But it seems like once we get a few goals, uh, we kind of carry it away pretty quickly. Uh oh, it popped up pretty high.
There we go. Bit of overcoming. He kind of popped it really high. He can't really score in that way. He could pop it towards the net and just make me have to save it or something. Oh. That was close. Oh, we forced him into the same pinch that I did earlier. That's like basically the same goal that the guy scored on me the last game, I believe. Where I kind of got under the ball. We got a quick forfeit. Hopefully that's two points. I don't think you can get three. I've never seen three before. Oh, wait, did we have two already? I could have swore we had one, right? Did I not wait long enough? <laughs> well, either way, this is the last game now. It's been a straight shot. I don't think we've lost a single game, so it's been really solid. We got Terran Rex. It's like T-Rex. Oh, he flipped. I think if he didn't flip there, he would have been fine. But he boosted uh, boosted above the ball. And then when he flicked, it went higher. So he would have been okay without a flip, I think. All right. Really solid start with four seconds. These kickoffs were a little bit too readable. Um, people are like doing a lot of fakes and slowing down and stuff. Close. Nice little block. Uh oh. Yeah, making sure I can grab onto the ceiling is good because I can. Uh, I can get some boost. Woo. Uh oh. Okay, that. <laughs> It worked out a lot better than I anticipated. I thought he was going to have it there. I was really low boost. I was a little bit scared. What the heck? There we go. Nice. Got the nice read off the backboard. Uh, I didn't have much boost to play with there. So I kind of had to just like sit there. And you can kind of uh, move yourself a little bit. Hey, there we go be a quick game here so i think that's gonna be into platinum now so pretty good episode about 38 minute recording but it, it'll probably be dropped down quite a bit and there's platinum one so in the next episode i play 1v1s the net will be higher and the, the field will be bigger which is really nice i hope you guys enjoyed definitely an interesting episode uh we got to see some different cars and different players uh there was no repeats of players i don't think not that i was aware of but uh until next time have a great day guys and i'll catch you guys in the next one